Hawalauea volcano is showing signs of escalating unrest. Volcanoes Hawaii National Park Signs of escalating unrest are underway at Hawaii's Kilauea volcano, according to the Hawaiian Volcano Observatory. A summit eruption may occur with little or no warning, but there is no sign that an eruption is imminent, the agency said. However, the earthquake rate below the peak region has increased from an average of around 20 per day to more than 40 per day over the past week, HVO noted in its latest update. No unusual activity was recorded along the eastern or southwestern Kilauea rift zones. HVO said levels of ground deformation were also high at the summit, similar to before the June 7 eruption. This week's earthquakes peaked at 100 on Sunday, August 13, including a magnitude 4.3 event felt across the island of Hawaii, the agency said in their latest update. Most of the other earthquakes are smaller than magnitude 2. The increase in seismicity at the Kilauea summit was accompanied by a brief increase in the degree of slope of the ground, which has returned to a steady state, HVO said. As gas emissions remain low, current observations suggest that magma is accumulating beneath the surface of the Kilauea summit region. The Volcano Alert Level Aviation Color Code for Kilauea remains at advisory, yellow status. One of the most active volcanoes on Earth, Kilauea is the youngest volcano on the Big Island of Hawaii and a key feature of Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. HVO is one of five volcano observatories in the U.S. Geological Survey and is responsible for monitoring volcanoes and earthquakes in Hawaii and American Samoa. Its last eruption occurred just over two months ago on June 7. It is non-destructive and remains within the creator. Currently, the volcano is showing signs of the degree of soil deformation at its peak, much like it did before the last eruption. Kilauea is also one of the most dangerous volcanoes in Hawaii. In 2018, an eruption caused a massive lava flow across Puna District, destroying more than 700 homes from May to August. The National Park's peak area changed dramatically as the volcano triggered tens of thousands of earthquakes. It was the largest volcanic eruption in 200 years and unusual in that most of Kilauea's eruptions tend to be less destructive, with most being in the crater. When an eruption does occur, the observatory broadcasts it live on its website, so it can be watched in real time. Webcams were set up to view various angles of the volcano. A forest fire on the island of Maui in Hawaii last week has left at least 96 people dead according to County of Maui officials. The death toll is expected to increase, 